This is the 1996 Tempest XPE 27 diesel. Tempest built this boat inspired by the Porsche Kineo. Wanted to give you a shot of this boat on its trailer. Trailer is included in the sale. And a close up look of starboard. And walk you down port side. And here's a shot from the bow looking straight back. And also, let's give you a look at the bottom of the hull. Just looks super clean. And let's give you a good shot of the aft while it's out of the water. And here's an up-close and personal look at these Mercury Diesel Bravo 1 drives. And you'll see just in fantastic condition. And a look at the starboard. And that'll bring us up to this Hardin offshore performance steering system for offshore racing and that brings us down to these Dana trim tabs and take a step back and give you another shot of this aft and let's go ahead and start the walkthrough tour on this Tempest 27 here you'll see performance bench seating now this is all a custom configuration you'll see the headrests created and also just a ton of room in this aft area this used to be just jump seats but just a terrific renovation. And if we look below the seating, you're gonna see stereo speakers, also stereo speakers here on the side, as well as your battery switch. And now that'll bring us up to these captains and first mate seating. Now these are performance seats and they're made by STID. They're some of the nicest seats made in the performance marine industry. Uh, they do all sorts of adjustments, back, forward, up and down, and they have built-in shock absorbers. This is just a huge upgrade and something the next captain and crew will certainly enjoy. And then if we go directly in front of the first mate, you'll see just great dry storage in there. Right now the current owner's got some sunscreen and whatnot stored in there, but just great glove box. And then within easy reach of the first mate is all the stereo controls. And if I step back and turn around, that brings us to our helm. And let's start here at the top. You're going to see a Garmin GPS map 172C. Then you're going to see your trim tab indicators, and those are Lavorsi, as well as the gauges are Lavorsi. Then if I come down here, you're going to see your trim tab controls, and then move over to the other side of the wheel, and you're going to see your Yanmar Smartcraft gauge, and then you're going to see all your switches to control your boat. And then move to the other side, and at the captain's fingertips, you'll see the drive controls, you'll see Lavorsi shifters, and then you'll see your Yanmar throttle control. And then if I move below, you'll see your VHF, and that is the helm on this Tempest 27. And that will move us down to our cuddy cabin. You'll see it has a very nice cuddy cabin. It's almost seven and a half feet in length, really nicely finished. And now let's go ahead and lift up the engine hatch. And that will give us a good view of this 2008 Yanmar 6LY3, which is a 480 horsepower diesel motor. And let's go ahead and even give us more access by pulling right here. And it opens up this engine room completely. And the first thing you'll notice is this Yanmar is facing aft. And the reason they do that is to open up all this space. It allows room for this big bench seat, allows you to carry five, six people. 
and also gives you great access to your drive system which is here in the front. And this is a good shot of this geared up drive system. And what this system allows, it allows you all the benefits of twins with a single diesel Yanmar. This drive system allows these drives to act independently just to give you that perfect maneuvering in close quarters and also out running. But one of the truly impressive things about this boat is not only just a great use of space, I mean plenty of room to get around this motor on each side and look how clean it is. I mean just incredibly clean engine space and just very impressive setup for this giant Yanmar freshwater cooled motor.